Hey guys, a very big happy Friday. Welcome to episode 203 of OP TV. What an incredible week it's been in real estate. Uh, we're now 29 days until Christmas Day, leaving four full weekends uh, left of the real estate market. Uh, what's going on in Adelaide at the moment? Uh, well, there's a 95% clearance rate uh, from last week uh, with 133 properties selling at auction. Uh, four of ours included, we'll get into in a minute, uh, but also 480 properties sold privately. Um, we're here at 111 Military Road in the beautiful Tennyson, the house behind me has been with the family many years uh, and it's first time on offer. Uh, it was the original house for this Tennyson area. They had a huge land holding all the way up to the sand dunes. Uh, but let's go take a look at this wonderful opportunity of over a thousand square meters of land going to auction before Christmas. Let's check it out. So guys, we've got some other wonderful releases this week. Nick and Matt have listed number 38 Cliff Street, a wonderful reproduction uh, courtyard home uh, in a great location. That's very well finished. That's open first this weekend. Uh, number one, well Road and Lights View. Uh, Sammy got a magnificent property there, uh, boasting six bedrooms, three bathrooms, three living areas, uh, a huge family home, very well priced. That's auction just before Christmas. Uh, also, we have number 1919A Milton Avenue, just released the market this week. They're due for completion late Feb, early March. Uh, two beautiful family homes under construction, guys. Check that one out. Uh, also coming soon, number 9A Prince Street in West Beach, a beautiful family seaside home. Uh, that's a very exciting property being released in January. Also a massive site, number 390 Sir Donald Bradman Drive uh, in Brooklyn Park. 14 townhouses on offer as a whole. So there's 14 owners that have come together uh, to sell the property. Uh, over 3,000 square meters of land holding, a multitude of options. Very, very exciting, guys. More information, hit our website. So guys, an article this week on domain.com talk about house prices peaking early 2022 uh, before taking a fall. Uh, a very interesting article that talks about Australia's white hot property market is set to reach its zenith by early 2022, according to a new report. SQM Research Christopher's housing boom and bust report 2022, released on Thursday, forecasts that dwelling prices across the nation will then drop in the second half of next year. Our expectation is that serviceability buffer rate will go from 3% to 3.5%, a recent statement that RBA's board will not increase the cash rate until the actual inflation is sustainably within the two to 3% target range. So guys, what does that mean for us? Uh, I think certainly we are gonna see some change with the banks. There certainly is gonna be some tightening of lending. Uh, and I guess with their, with their loan books, looking at uh, consolidating those to uh, lower LVRs, uh, and obviously being very selective with which clients they're lending to. So now's the time to certainly get into the market. If you're thinking of making a move in the next 12 months, there still is certainly time before Christmas. Uh, we've got about six or seven auctions lined up, uh, but also a very exciting 2022. So let's talk. So guys, we had four auctions this weekend. The first one at 9 a.m. on Saturday morning, 234 Seaview Road in Henley Beach South. A beautiful property uh, that was actually a 1940s character masonette uh, that had a 2016 extension. A lot of interest on that property. Uh, we had multiple bidders. Uh, that one's selling for 1.665 million uh, at 9 a.m. Saturday morning. Uh, Nick and Matt had a property at number 47 Belfast Street uh, in the beautiful Henley Beach. A great 50s home with a fantastic renovation. Uh, they had spirited bidding. Uh, it happened very fast. Uh, Brent did a magnificent auction on that property. Uh, that one's selling for 1.337 million. Uh, and then uh, just after lunch, we had number 12 Blue Lake Court in Tennyson. That property, a magnificent waterfront property that's been vacant for the last couple of years, uh, on offer for a demolition to build one or two homes. We had 18 registered bidders, a huge crowd, uh, and Brett Rowenfeld did an amazing job. Uh, the auction kicking off at 1.4 million and selling for a record $2.205 million. A new lake record by a country mile with the property only 11 months ago, the same, selling only in March of this year 
for 1.42 million. This one's selling for 2.205 million. That's an $800,000 increase in eight months. 38 Adelphi Crescent in Glenelg North, the much anticipated auction. We held that on Sunday, just gone. Uh, there was a huge crowd, a couple of hundred people attended uh, the waterfront property over 900 square meters uh, of prime land to develop one, two or three homes or retain a great investment property with three units. Uh, the, the, the property had over 200 families through the property over the past four weeks. Uh, we had 23 registered bidders, that kicking off at 1.8 million, uh, hitting reserve very quickly and selling for a million, massive $2.455 million. Uh, absolutely smashed the record for Adelphi Terrace in the Glenelg North area. Very proud to bring that result to the owners and very big congratulations to the new buyer who's building their magnificent new home on the waterfront. So guys, upcoming auctions this weekend, number three, Allen Avenue in Royal Park. That one's open from 9.30, auction at 10. Uh, expected that to be a fantastic auction. Uh, James Peddler is gonna be the auctioneer there. So what's on this weekend? Uh, the Glenelg Markets is on uh, from Sunday at 11 a.m. Obviously family fun with stalls, rides, all sorts of things. So guys, head on down, it should be a lot of fun. Uh, so that's it from us this week, guys. From all of the team at Oz Property, wishing you a fantastic weekend. Remember, if you're thinking property, think Oz Property, let's talk.